All right. And we're back with more Cthulhu Saves the World. We have pwned the enemies of Relier. And now it's time for some non-Euclidic Dungeoneering. And I have to remember where to go. It's this way. Uh-oh. I'm slow. Oh, boy. This dungeon is uh, twisty at best. But we're going to get Cthulhu one heck of a suit worth of awesome items in this dungeon. So I'm all right with that. First up will be his tunic. And it's actually called Cthulhu's tunic, so we know it belongs to him. Of course, the whole tunic part probably helps with that. And there she is right there. Let's equip it. It's pretty awesome, actually. Let's take a look here. You got strength 50, magic 50, agility 50, vitality 200, will 150. Can be used by Cthulhu. So we'll put that bad boy on. And then we're going to go back down this way. Let's circle all the way around. We're going to see the exit and then hit to the next treasure chest. This is a very windy dungeon. And uh, when I first saw the water down there, I got a little concerned that we'd have to be running down in the water, kind of like we did in the, sh the water shrine. But thankfully, no. The water shrine was rough. Um, all in all, these dungeons aren't too bad, to be honest. I mean, they, they take you maybe... 15 minutes to make it through and uh, that's of course after you've done all the fighting mind you but in comparison to some dungeons from some of the RPG classics I've played of my youth that uh, that's nothing some of the games I played when I was younger you would spend hours in a dungeon and then you'd have to climb all the way back out of the damn thing so let's see I think it's is it this way Probably not. Yeah, not. It wouldn't be a dungeon unless I forgot where I was going. But yeah, I uh, I remember some of my earlier JRPG experiences being just miserable when you'd hit a dungeon. Just dungeon floor after dungeon floor. And, oh, God. So thankfully, this game does not go that way. Now, there's the stairs up to the next level that we need to go to. But first, we need to go down this way so we can get the last treasure chest in here. This way. Yes. Now, if you keep going down this way, you're going to wind up back at the beginning where you were. So you don't need to. You just need to hang right here. And at the end of this little hallway, the treasure. Oh, yes. So let's equip Cthulhu weapon. And it's Cthulhu sword. 50% damage to insane. So that's... Add strength 250, magic 150, agility 50, vitality 200, will 50. It's good stuff. Yeah. All right, so we're going to head back to that staircase and uh, go on up. I'll edit that out, so I will see you guys on the next floor. Okay, we're back. Now, after you go up the staircase, you find a long hallway, basically, and uh, there's really no need to show you how you do that. You just go up. Hooray, until you get here. Now, once again, this is going to start as a long hallway. There is one deviation which I will show you, but basically you're going to curve all the way up and around for this tomfoolery. That treasure chest right above us there is what we're going after first. So this shouldn't be too bad. But then later, in the same floor, after you get past this long curly bit, it does get a little twisty. And as they would say, non-euclidic is a term I never could understand when I was a youngster. One-ups! I don't use those. How many do I have? 17. Good lord. I think I've used like a few. Alright, so you're going to head left here and follow this path all the way around. And I will pick the video back up at the next crossroad that you need to know about. Alrighty. We are back with more. You're going to come to this crossroads. Hang a left. You're going to find your next treasure chest. And although it's an item I'm not going to be using, at least you'll know where it is. Today, Chaos Blade, which is a blade for Chape. There it is right there. Random target. For him, I don't like random target. Now, obviously, I'm not using Sharp. In fact, the team I'm with right now is who I'm going to carry through to the end of the game. But at least you know where that weapon is in case you do want to use it with Sharpe. And uh, 
in case you want to use Sharpay in general. I find that the team I'm working with right now is is who I enjoy the most. Now, to the right, it's a dead end, so just keep heading up this way. It's going to get a little windy here. Because why not? But basically, we're going to go and we're going to find another exit and then continue past that exit once again. I believe it's this way. And find another treasure chest. I like this epic music. Tis the final battle. Oh, yeah. Getting pumped. That's a dead end that way. Let's go this way. Hey, look. Empty treasure chest. The sign of a good time. I believe we go up. Yes. Treasure chest. Ta-da. Potions. I will take it, your potions. We should be coming along to the lights that kind of tell us we're heading in the right direction any second now, I believe. At least we should be, if I remember correctly. I might not remember correctly, though. That has been known to happen in the past. Especially when I just fought... Ooh, there you go. Yeah, we're going the right way. Especially when I just fought through 50 freaking fights in a row. My god. Like I said, though, you get Umi's death ability, it gets a lot easier. Oh, no. Am I going the wrong way? I don't want to be going the wrong way. No, I think I'm doing good, actually. I think, think we're in. Yes, there they are. Okay, good. The wonderful pots of light that tell you, hey. Now, up to the top here, whoop, staircase. But go this way so that you may get... Treasure. Treasure so important they put it at the end of the game. There it is. Give me that. Antimatter claw for pause. Quite a bit of a boost, and it ignores defense, so I will equip that. I'm not using him. I know, I know. But I'm just saying, if I was using him, that would be equipped. So we're going to head back up and go up the stairs. Right here. Beautiful. Now the levels are split by these kind of outside periods. Oh. Do I want to save? Sure. Let's save. There we go. And, oh. Uh-oh. We recognize these three jerks. Stop right there, fiend. We have gathered the seven holy crystals and have the power to stop you. Raising Relay to the surface? How predictable. Your evil stops here. Wait, he's a good guy. We're the heroes. Don't bother. The only thing these guys will listen to is a swift kick to the head. Well, then let's deliver said kick. Let's see how tough are they. Really, guys? Really? You made it this far? Just kill them. Goodbye. <laughs> Chumps. Uh, that was surprisingly easy. Yes, easy indeed. We can't afford to be distracted. We must press on. All right. Let me keep it across this bridge, and we'll be on, I think, the third floor of Rulia. Rulia, yeah. Yes, there we go. Staircases. Whoop. And this should be floor three, right? Yeah. All right, so the floor three shall commence it. Okay, we are now in Rillier yeah, three. Uh, there's the stairwell that we just came up at the end of the hallway after defeating the triplets of loserness. Now they are so lame. I guess all that time spent finding crystals just didn't pay off. Hmm. And uh, we're gonna go find them some more treasure chests. There are three. Sure, three. Yeah, that's the ticket. Anyway, this ends up being just another long, windy adventure. Uh, left. I think is where I went. Yes, this looks right. Wait. This could be wrong. Let's go back that way. Yeah, this is the way I went. Okay. I want to make sure I go the same way this time. Uh-oh. 
wait. I think I'm slowly remembering. <laughs> this is bad. This dungeon level is tricky. Lots of twists and turns to get you lost. This wouldn't be an issue if you're just playing through and trying to uh, get to the end. But when you're trying to get to all the treasure chests, it can be pretty frustrating. I don't think there's one down here, right? No. Frustrating for a shooter, especially when you're so close. So close to knowing how it ends. Boy, for an old man, uh, Daker sure can't keep up. Let's see, is it this way? Wait, is it? I don't think it. Well, maybe it is this way. It is this way. Hooray! How did I do that? Gold. 99,999 gold. I got a lot of gold. Whole lot of gold. Alright, so we're gonna go this way. I think. Yeah, okay, so we're seeing the lights. I've gone backwards somehow. How did I do that? I don't know. How did you do that, Zara? How'd you go backwards? I don't know, me. I just don't know. There is a treasure chest in here with some armor for October that I want to get. I believe it's this way. It better be this way. Why am I not remembering this at all? This is bad. I'm going to have to start writing down these maps again. You should see these papers I have, everybody, just with these twisty, squiggly lines all over them. All just so I can remember where the treasure chests are. Excuse my squeaky chair. I know you lost the game, hates it, so here you go, buddy. Have a listen. There it is. Sanity staff. That's for, uh, for the Daker. Whoops. Who, uh, does not need it, in my opinion. Let's take a look at it. Here it is. Now, it is a nice boost of stat and everything, but it causes insanity 100% of the time. And I don't want uncontrollable insanity causing. I don't want it. I just don't want it. Alright, I'm going to head back to where the stairs are, and we'll take up from there. I knew I missed one. It's down this way, and it's the one I'm looking for. I'm going to head down here, get this treasure chest, and end the video. And then the next video will be up the stairs. I think we've got one or two more floors left. This is a pretty long dungeon, which I guess would explain why there's 50, 50 fights to have to go through. I couldn't imagine slowly walking through this whole way with fighting monsters the whole way. That would drive me crazy. Eps, well, I guess it is Relier, so any kind of craziness driving would make perfect sense. Down here is the treasure chest. There she is. Black Tome. Now that is for October. Magic 300. Will 150. Dark plus 50%. Handy as all get out. So let's save our progress. And I will see you guys for the next video. I'm going to head back to those stairs. Shoot up the stairs and I will see you then. Be excellent to each other.